Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to see how to pass custom field values in a chat transcript whenever this uh, chat is initiated using embedded service chat. Uh, for this uh, video, I am using embedded service deployment, which makes use of chat transcript object or entity. First, create couple of custom fields in your uh, chat transcript standard object. Here I have created skill and also I have created text. Skill is a pick list field and text is a text of 10. Um, the maximum size is 10 or the length is 10. So I'm going to make use of these two fields. Whenever the chat is uh, initialized, I'm going to pass values to this two fields whenever I'm using embedded service deployment. So I created these two fields and uh, you can make use of this lightning aura component as the uh, pre-chat component. In the pre-chat component, when you try to initialize uh, the chat, you can dispatch an event. So here I'm dispatching an event with the name custom field. Detail, I am having a callback method uh, or a function so component dot find of pre chat api dot start chat dot bind of this comma fields so I'm, since i'm using lightning uh, snap in pre chat api using which i'm going to start the chat uh, with this as the scope and then i'm passing the fields and along with the callback function i am passing two other parameters one is text and the other one is skill for text i am sending testing as the value and for skill i am sending service as the value and then i am dispatching it so in the pre chat form whenever start chat button is clicked it will fire an event with the name set custom field so the, and in salesforce in the embedded service deployment in the chat settings in the pre chat uh, uh, the standard lightning component you have to select the lightning aura component which we discussed so it is configured now we, you have to go to the site where your uh, embedded service deployment is hosted and you have to use embedded underscore svc dot settings dot extra pre chat form details it should be an array so i am using the transcript fields as text underscore underscore c and skill underscore underscore c which i will be getting it from here next you have to add add event listener for the custom event which you are going to pass it from the pre-chat lightning aura component here I have a couple of console log dot statements to find out whether the values are passed correctly and using embedded underscore svc dot settings dot extra p chart form details. So for the first index or the zeroth index I'm passing um, the first value or the zeroth index I'm getting I'm setting the value as even dot detail dot text for the second value or the first index value I'm setting even dot detail dot skill and then I'm using the callback method which will actually fire start chat so it will initialize the chat so we have to do uh, these two things in your code where you are hosting the embedded service deployment so first set up extra pre chat form details with the custom field api names next add document dot add event listener to the event which you are going to dispatch or fire it from the lightning aura component and then set the value now let's test it out so i'm going to initialize the chat so once i click start chat i will receive an uh, once I click start chat, it will dispatch an event and then uh, uh, my website will set all the extra pre chat form details value. 
to text uh, underscore underscore c custom field and skill underscore underscore c custom field and then it will start the chat let's initialize the chat so i got the chat i am able to accept it if i go to details so it passed the text and skill so using lightning aura component and uh, event listener i was able to pass custom field values whenever the chat is initiated please check the video description in the video description i have shared my blog post from the blog post you should be able to get the sample code which we referenced in this video i hope it was helpful thank you for watching